y'all, it's Danielle, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to do Lewis structures. <clears throat> the first thing you do when doing a Lewis structure is figure out how many electrons will be in the valence of that element. In chlorine, there's seven valence electrons, so here you write seven, and you have to multiply that seven by a two because there's going to be two chlorine atoms in this specific Lewis structure. So that's 14, but you have to find out how many pair of electrons there's going to be. So you have to do 14 divided by two, and that equals seven, which means there's going to be seven pairs in this Lewis structure. So you write out the um, atoms, you have to write out the atoms, and you just start drawing pairs. So there's this is one pair, this is two pair, this is three pair, and there's a lone seven dot. Over here there's one pair, two pair, three pair, and that lone seventh dot. So what you do is you have to draw a bond. And this bond is basically the connecting point between these two elements, these two lone elements, signifying that the two atoms will now share the electrons. So it's going to end up looking like this. And they're going to be sharing these two electrons. So it's going to be this is one pair, this is two pair, three pair, four pair. And that uh, satisfies the octet rule of having eight electrons in one valence. And then this is one pair, two pair, three pair, and this is the fourth pair, also signifying the, um, this is signifying the octet rule or satisfying the octet rule. So, this will be the fi finished product. So this is one pair of electrons, two pair of electrons, and three pair of electrons, four pair of electrons, five pair of electrons, six pair of electrons, and this is the seventh showing the two, um, symbolizing the two dots. So this is that. Next we have hydrogen. This hydrogen has only one valence electron, so that's one times two. That's two, but again we have to find out how many pair there are going to be, so that's two divided by two, which is one. So this is one pair of electron. H, H, and there's one dot here and one dot here. So you're going to draw that line signifying the sharing of two bonds. And by the way, these both are covalent bonds, which means bonds that share electrons. Here you're sharing an electron. Here you're sharing um, the electrons. So here is H2O. And see, as we know, hydrogen has one electron in the valence. And there's going to be two atoms, so that's two, plus oxygen has six valence electrons. So you're going to add six, that equals eight, but we have to find out how many pair they're going to be. So we have to do eight divided by two, and that equals four. This is the colon. So um, four pair, we're going to have O and then H, H. This is going to be the signal of sharing two bonds. So this is going to be two, two, because these are the two, th these lines symbolize the two electrons that will be shared between the two atoms. And then we're going to have a two right here, two electrons right here and two electrons right here. So this is one pair, two pair, three pair, and four pair. And this signifies four pair of electrons. Um, Thank you so much, and I hope this helps.